Okay, welcome to... Uh, obscure Depths. Welcome to Obscure Depths. On tonight's show, we are going to be interviewing Question Mark and cakes. We, cakes, and we are going to be um. Let's see. We're going to be saying names of the game. This is what's going to happen. He, I'm going to read a game, and he's going to say who will win. Oh, for a first game, it is Arizona Cardinals against the State. St. Louis Rams at 8.20 p.m. Who will win? Uh, Arizona is a one-point favorite on the road. Um, they struggled a little bit against uh, Miami last week, and this is a divisional game, so this is kind of really a hard one to call, especially being just a one-point favorite. So, um, I'm going to go with the home team. How about that? Arizona loses their first game at St. Louis in a divisional game. All right? The Mi next, the Miami Dolphins against the Cincinnati Bengals. Who will win? Cincinnati is a three and a half point favorite. They're the home team here. Um, I, I like Miami in this game, actually. Um, Cincinnati gives up a lot of rushing yards, and uh, I think Reggie Bush could run wild against them. So, so I think Miami's going to go into Cincy and beat them. Okay, the next game, the Green Bay Packers against the Indianapolis Colts. Who will win? Green Bay is a six-and-a-half point favorite on the road. I, I like I like Green Bay in this one. Um, obviously, you know, uh, the Colts are going to have their problems, and this is going to be one of the games that they're going to struggle struggle with, I believe. So I like, I like Green Bay to go in there and win this game by a touchdown easy. Okay, next. I mean, okay, next. Green Bay, I mean, Baltimore Ravens against... The Cincinnati... No, nope. Kansas City Chiefs. The Kansas City Chiefs. Who will win? The Ravens are a six-point favorite at Kansas City. Um, you know, this is such a hard place to play. People don't really realize what a hard place that is to play. So I'm going to go with the home team in this. I like KC. I think they could, uh, I think they could do a couple things that's going to frustrate Baltimore, and I think they're going to hang within six. Okay, next. Cleveland Browns against the New York Giants. Who will win? Cleveland going to New York. They're a seven and a half point dog. Um, yeah, the Giants are just gonna just gonna wax them here. I think that you might see a good first half, but I think the Giants are gonna take this game by two touchdowns at least. You know, that's that's the way everybody's probably thinking too, but I, yeah, I think this is probably a good obvious pick, even though even though that's a decent point spread for an NFL game. That's that's a good strong pick. Okay. Next. Philadelphia Eagles against the Pittsburgh Steelers. Battle of win? Battle of PA at Pittsburgh. Um, Pittsburgh's three and a half point favorites, or excuse me, a three point favorite. They are the home team here. Um, you know, Philly's been getting a lot of heat, but. Remember, folks, they're three and one, and Pittsburgh lost to the Raiders. So um, that being said, uh, I think Philly's going to win this game, the Battle of Pennsylvania. I think Philly's going to go in there and beat beat Pittsburgh. Um, so I think they'll probably win this game by touchdown, even though they're three point dogs. Okay, next, Atlanta Falcons against the Washington Redskins. Who will win? Atlanta is a three point favorite on the road. Love Atlanta. I'm gonna make this my lock of the week. They easy they easily win this game by ten points. They're gonna go in there and exploit every weakness that, that Washington has and they're gonna just trounce them. So yes, I like Atlanta minus the three. Okay, next. Let's see. Um what what should we do? What should we do? Seattle Seahawks against the Cowboys 
Carolina Panthers. The Carolina Panthers. Who will win? Carolina, three-point favorite at home in this one. Um, Seattle doesn't travel well. They're gonna, they're gonna. Carolina's gonna beat them by a touchdown, I think. I, I, you know, Carolina's caught a lot of heat in the last couple of weeks about, you know, their their drive and their determination. But I think, I think Carolina's gonna take this game easy. Okay. Next. Chicago Bears against the Jacksonville Jaguars. Who will win? Chicago is a six-point favorite on the road. Uh, their defense just looked awesome Monday night at, at Dallas. Six points seems like a lot, but I'm going to take that. I think they win this game by ten. Jacksonville is just not very good. Again, I like this being a good first half. And then Chicago, you know, if 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 Cutler can keep ahead about himself, they're going to come out and really play well in the second half and make this make this not a pretty game, I think, eventually. Okay, next game. Tennessee Titans uh, at the Minnesota Vikings. Who will win? Minnesota, five-and-a-half point favorites as they host Tennessee. Uh, yeah, I like Tennessee. I like Minnesota to win this game. Um, I do not think it's going to be... Within five and a half. Minnesota's minus Aww. five and a half. I think this is going to be a field goal type of game. You know, Matt Hasselback back back in action. And I think uh, Tennessee's going to kind of rally around him and make this a good game. I do think Minnesota wins this by a field goal, yes. but I like this being a very good game. Woo. Okay, next. Um, Denver Broncos against the New England Patriots. Who will win? New England, six-and-a-half-point favorites as they host the Broncos. Manning versus Brady. <sighs> this is going to be a good game. Um, but I like, I, like the, I, like, I, like, I like New England to win this. Um, is it going to be six-and-a-half, seven points? <sighs> yeah, it is. They're going to win this game by ten points. Brady, hey. Bra you know Brady's been watching film, and he's going to exploit that really good Denver defense. So... I think I like them definitely to win this game by ten points in this game. Okay. Next, Buffalo Bills. Buffalo Bills against the San Francisco 49ers. Who will win? Biggest spread of the weekend. San Francisco is ten point favorites at home. Hmm. Well, I just don't know. Buffalo didn't look very good last week. Sam Fran looked awesome, but they didn't do very good offensively. Um, yeah, I suppose Sam Fran can win this game by 10 points at home. I don't think it's going to be a high-scoring game, but I think Sam Fran wins this like 17-6 or 21-10, that type of thing. So I like the 10 points. I'm going to take Sam Fran, minus 10. Okay, next. San Diego Chargers at New Orleans Saints. Who will win? <sighs> 0-4 New Orleans. The Chargers are not a team that travels particularly well. Um, so let's see here. The Saints are three and a half point favorites at home. I don't know if a 0-4 team has ever been favored. I'm sure they probably have. But you know, everybody keeps waiting for this team to wake up, and I think this is definitely going to be the week. I think. I think they are. I think they ha have suffered through enough now, and I think they're gonna. This is gonna be the game they break out and just wax the Chargers. So, sorry, Philip Rivers, but Drew Brees is gonna always gets hyped up to play his former team. So they're gonna they're gonna take him down. Last game Monday night. Okay, Houston Texans against the New York Jets. Who will win? The Jets are eight point dogs. Why did I say the Jets first? I don't know because I like Houston. Eight points, yeah. Give me minus eight all day. Houston is arguably next to Atlanta the best team in football. I think those two teams are going to meet in the Super Bowl, Atlanta-Houston. I'm not making it my lock of the week like Atlanta, but I think Houston wins this game by 10, maybe 14, 13 points. I think, you know, I think... Yeah, and that's that's Houston on the road. I can't remember last time somebody's been an eight-point favorite on the road. But, you know, the Jets looked terrible last week, and I think Houston's defense against the Jets' terrible offense is going to be not a pretty thing. Um, 
I don't know if it's going to be as bad as it was last week, but they're going to win this game by eight points, definitely. So I'll take Houston minus eight. This has been Obscure Depths. We are a division of Metal Fraker Productions. That's M-E-T-A-L-F-R-A-K-E-R. Find us on Facebook at Metal Fraker Productions. Thank you. And we'll see you later. And tune in next time for the next episode of Obscured Depths. One, two, three.